Good morning. I love you guys. It's good to see you again. Hope you're all um, bright and bushy-tailed. I love you, and I'm very proud of you, and I'm honored to be in your presence. <laughs> How you guys doing? Did you have a good weekend? Did you survive the weekend? <laughs> Was it more work um, having a weekend off than it was working? <laughs> but sometimes we do more work when we're supposed to be relaxing than we do when we're actually working. Sometimes people are relieved to get back to work. <laughs> That's not so good. I think we need to be able to make our homes a haven, a place where we're in control and happy not that we're trying to control everybody and everything, but where we are in a position to find a balance in our lives where we can find um, satisfaction in our in our homes, you know? I think that's so important. And I'm not <clears throat> saying, excuse me, that we spend our time making sure we get what we want all the time, because that's not the answer either. But <clears throat> we live by ourselves. Well, of course it can be, because we don't have anybody else to have to deal with when we get home, unless we got a pet. But if we have like family that we're living with or roommates or whatever, it's different. You know, so we have to um, be able to work with people and um, <clears throat> find a happy balance for both, <clears throat> both or all individuals included. And sometimes as parents, we have children and we don't include them in our planning in terms of what we're going to do in the household to bring peace or for everybody to get what they need or want out of the situation. Sometimes as adults, we completely overlook children because we think, well, they don't matter. But little kids have needs. You know, kids are people too. They have stuff that will make their lives better and easier. And um, <clears throat> sometimes as adults, we forget what it's like to be a child and to feel powerless and to feel like we have no matter what we say or do, it's not gonna matter. It's like a little prison sentence. You're so little and tiny and nobody pays any attention to you because you're small, your voice is small and it makes a child feel like they don't matter. And I think that's something that we don't need to do. <clears throat> if we've been doing it, we need to work on not doing it. We need to help children to feel empowered in positive ways without being disrespectful or arrogant or pushy because kids can take that <coughs> excuse me and flip it <coughs> excuse me but sometimes I think that comes um, from <coughs> us not parenting correctly um, or in helpful ways because sometimes we are giving our children too much responsibility and allowing them to make too many choices um, when they're too young, when they don't really know what the heck they want. And they don't know and they can't know because they're too small. <clears throat> and it's our job as parents and as adults to choose for them. Maybe we can have them be a part of our choices, but at the end of the day, <coughs> excuse me, sorry, <clears throat> as a part of the choice making, we can let the kid be included in it. It builds their self-esteem and it also teaches them how to make decisions on their own. So just something to think about, you know, but it's um, great being back. I hope you have a wonderful week and hope your day starts out really good. You know, not just here, but when you get out there doing your thing, hope it's uh, a smooth day. And if you're working from home, if you're just at home, I hope your day is a smooth day at home. I hope you're feeling well. And if not, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> you have no allergies. If it's not, I hope it gets better. I hope you feel better. You know, when you take care of yourself. Don't rush through trying to feel better so you can take care of other people or other things. Let yourself, let your health be priority for you. Have a fabulous day. Be happy. Smile. Be positive. Fill your head with good stuff because your head needs it. Your whole body needs it. Your soul needs it. And keep pushing good, 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 good stuff.
to yourself, or pushing out good stuff to other people. So, you're my celebrity. You know I'm your biggest fan. Have a fabulous day, and I will see you in the morning. Please, you know you're my road dog. So I love you guys. Bye-bye.